Let us sit here. I have broken two engagements for you today, and both of them with Percy Grice. How many have you broken for me? None. My only engagement at Bellamont was with you. You really came to Bellamont to see me? Of course I did. Why? Because I always like to see what you're doing. You're such a wonderful spectacle. Well, now that you are here, you can see the effect firsthand. Oh, I don't flatter myself that my coming here has deflected your course of action by a hair's breadth. Oh, do give me one. I haven't smoked in days. Why such unnatural abstinence? Because it is not considered becoming in a jeune fille à marier. And at the present moment, I am a jeune fille à marier. You must suppose me a dull kind of person if you think I never yield to an impulse. But I don't suppose that. Your genius lies in converting impulses into intentions. My genius? My genius would appear to be my ability to do the wrong thing at the right time. Or vice versa. Is there any final test of genius but success? I certainly haven't succeeded. But you will marry someone very rich. What a miserable future you foresee for me. Haven't you seen it for yourself? Of course. But it seems so much darker when you show it to me. Why do you do this to me? Why do you make the things that I have chosen seem hateful to me? If you have nothing to give me instead? No, I have nothing to give you instead. If I had, it should be yours. You know that. But you belittle me in being so sure they're the only things I care for. Isn't it natural that I should try to belittle all the things I can't offer you? Do you want to marry me? No. I don't. But perhaps I should, if you did. It would be a great risk. I have never concealed from you how great. You are a coward. No. It's you who are the coward. Are you serious? Why not? I took no risk in being so. Getting late. Let us go down. <laughs> 